everyone and this is crafty matt 13 oh uh with another let's play video uh today i want to show you how to register to become a member on noobstown uh noobstown is our uh is our server that we play on our favorite server that we play on uh, the only server that i actually play on um so you can see it listed right here i uh, will show you the um don't want to delete it want to edit it uh, you see right here under server name it's noobstown and then the server address is noobstown n-o-o-b-s-t-o-w-n dot com so i want to show you how quick how quick and easy it is to uh, to get registered on it to become a member i also want to go over the uh, website for you and pick out a few things on the website to show you that uh, is very handy and very important um, on Noobstown. It's very important to check the Noobstown website frequently because there are um, events and things that, that go on throughout the month and the different months uh, that the admins do for the server. Uh, and it is really a fun server. So they have just started um, Easter on Noobstown, you see here, um, there's a new quest. Uh, we do monthly quests on Noobstown, and a new quest just started today. Uh, and it's, of course, you know, it's Easter based, since Easter is just right around the corner, uh, with it being next week. Uh, and apparently, there are uh, within the Towny Worlds and the Wild World, there are um, Easter eggs that spawn that you will get a message uh, in your chat if you are on and you see a message that says an easter egg just spawned near you it will not of course tell you where it is you have to go find it so i'm going to do another video on um under my crafty mat 13oh account um i'm going to do another video on um the the easter egg hunt so apparently there's going to be different uh, different events throughout this week. Uh, not sure what they are. Um, but we just finished up a uh, birthday party on Noobstown. And I want to apologize too. I was supposed to be four parts on that. And the fourth part was supposed to be a fishing tournament. But somehow or another uh, <laughs> I messed up. And it did not record the fishing tournament. So I do apologize. So there is actually only three parts. Uh, the first part being the drop party, the second part um, being spleef, and then the third part being the boat races. So I do apologize that I was not able to get the fishing tournament um, up there as promised. So, But we do have also community-wide fishing tournaments. Uh, so anyway, let's get started here, and I'll show you how to register on Noobstown. I'm going to go ahead and minimize this, uh, and I'm going to bring up the web page here and as you can see the the web page um is www.noobscraft.com and this is our forums page and i'm actually going to log in under a new alternate account that i have uh it is called not a crafty so we're going to be using that today um to show you how quick and easy it is to register so let's go ahead and get started so since i am basically going to be considered a, a new member on here i'm going to want to click on register and we'll go ahead and do that so and as you can see here uh the different um as a member um of course like i said it's completely free uh you can be a full member in a community of over 40,000 Minecrafters. You'll have the member title in game uh, next, to your, next to your name. You can take part in all server events and competitions. Uh, you will have full access to the site um, and the forums. You can view all of the latest server and site news, view all server and site statistics and high scores. Um, we, do, we do have MC MMO uh, skills and on the server those are listed uh, actually the top 10 in each uh, skill are listed um, you could have quick access to the server live map which, which I will also 
also show you the ability to purchase unlimited protected in-game land. Um, now, as a as a member, you can get uh, in the wild world, and I'll show you the um, um, I'll show you the different worlds in another video. Um, but in the wild world, you can claim as many chunks as you want, and as a member, you can have ten free uh, wild chunks. And they they have to be connected. If they are not connected, uh, then there is a, a small fee to claim an unconnected chunk. Um, but as a as a guest, you are limited to two chunks. Uh, you can also earn extra free protected land just for playing. I'll show you that as well on the website. Um, for every three hours that you play, and it's cumulative time, so. For every three hours that you play, you earn an extra free chunk. So if you say we're playing for two and a half hours and then you have to leave, you can log out. Uh, but then when you log back in, you don't have to start over with that three hours. It'll just be cumulative and you'll just have to play that another 30 minutes to get that free chunk. Um, under towns, when you are a, a member, you'll be able to apply and start a town and be a mayor uh, if you want um, and I'll explain that in another video um, about how to start a town. Uh, it does take uh, in-game money that you'll have to earn and whatnot. We call our in-game money noobs uh, but like I said in another video I'll explain um, all of that and as a member you can get uh, support and help in-game uh, quickly and easily quickly and easily get support when not on the server if needed uh, automatically get told about updates updates in game suggest and tell us what we should work on or add to the server uh, to make noobs town just that much better uh, we're always looking for ways to to uh, make noobs town better for everyone uh, automatically join in global channel when you connect you can also contact other members on the site and then also you can apply uh, able to apply to be server staff um, when you're a member so and you know plus there's some more stuff uh, that I'll cover in another video but right now let's go ahead and click on register me now and right now here's my minecraft um, username for this account not a crafty okay let me type in my my email here let me just make sure that this is right not a craft okay that's right Sorry. now then let me see if i can make sure this is right Hopefully that is right. Now then, we have to type in this verification code. So we will do that. Okay, now hopefully I've got everything right. I had a little bit of a problem with my email the other day when I was trying to... Okay, let me try this again. Well, it's saying checking details, so let's see. Let's see if it's gonna gonna work here for me. But like I said, you know, we, we do have a lot of fun here on Noobstown. There's a lot of different uh, community-wide events that the uh, admins put on. We just finished up Noobstown. Uh, fifth birthday party we had a uh, double XP all week uh, for the MC MMO skills and that was really fun and then just this last Friday night uh, we did a birthday party and like I said I, I did videos we had a drop party that went on for a little over an hour um, then we had a little bit of a, about a five minute break then we went into spleef um, 
Then we had boat races, and then we had uh, a fishing tournament, uh, which unfortunately I had some technical issues and did not get the uh, fishing tournament. So hopefully this will tell me that I'm registered. I'm not sure if I should... Hit stop and try it again. So it's still working. Usually it's a little bit quicker than this. I had tried to do this the other day um, and had a little bit of technical issues with my video, so I am re redoing it. But it's usually pretty quick. But once this finishes, then you'll need to. Um, you need to have an email account, uh, and then you'll need to check, once this finishes, I'll need to check my email um, from Noobscraft, and then you click on the link to activate your email. And if you do not see your, your email in your new email folder, then make sure you check your spam folder or your junk folder, because sometimes it will show up in there. So why is this? You may just click log in and see what. Nope, that username does not exist. Okay, let me go back to register and see. Okay, let me try to click on register me now. Okay, that looks right. Okay, let me try this again. these letters again. Oh, now it's going to do it again. Let me click the back button. Is this capitalized? Okay, let me see if this is right. Hopefully this will work again. Usually it's not. Okay. Here, hopefully that's right because I did not get a, your passwords do not match.
So it's checking details. But I've been playing on Noobstown for uh, about two years. Uh, my whole family plays on it. Um, and it looks like we have succeeded. Okay, so we have step two is check your email. Thank you for registering. We're almost done becoming a member. Just one more step. Um, then we have to check our email account. Uh, that you use to register with. Uh, and if you don't receive an email after a few minutes, make sure you check your spam folder. That, that's very important. Um, and then you have to click on the link that's within the email that you receive to activate your account. So I will jump over to my email here. I will And see, here is my email. So I will go into this. Okay, before you can log in, you first need to activate your account. To do so, please follow this link. So I'm going to click on this link right here. Okay. My account has been successfully activated. You can now proceed to log in. Okay, so, and this worked. So, I am now logged into the website as Not a Crafty. Now, briefly on the website, um, you'll want to check the website often because, like I said, there are um, different updates, uh, different server announcements that comes up. Um, about new happenings that are going on for Noobstown. Let's just go ahead and click on this and I'll show you. See right here, it talks about our um, Noobstown turning five years old just the other day. So in the, um, the mining world and the nether and the end reset, pretty much usually monthly. Sometimes it, it can go up to two months, but the admins do a really good job at uh, resetting the uh, mining world, nether, and end worlds that we have. Um, but it's very important to go to make sure that you check the website often. Uh, right here, uh, you can click on the home and see right here it's, it's mentioning Easter. Um, new Easter theme has been released, uh, and I'll do another video on. Um, the new Easter quest that has just come out. We do have a server-wide uh, Easter egg hunt, uh, Easter egg spawn in the uh, town world and the uh, wild worlds that you can find. Um, and when you find those, and I'll do a video on that as well, but when you find those, you will get like a little token that you can save. And at the end of this week, you can trade in those tokens for um, special limited uh, heads that uh, the admins do and uh, those are really fun collectible things that you can you can get and uh, you can either sell them if you want or um, a lot of people set up uh, little display cases display areas uh, and save them so um, that is really fun and then you've got your forums page uh, so just make sure you check out the forums page. It has all different sorts of stuff on here. Support. Uh, if you need support, if something is going on that you don't understand uh, or something is not working right, you can post a message here under support um, and get help with that. Under community, let me show you the live map. Uh, this is really neat. Uh, right here, uh, this is Noobstown Spawn, and we do have some events that goes on in Noobstown Spawn, um, and this is really a fun thing to look at. Uh, as you can tell, we've got a couple people in, actually we've got Lord Archer is, is over here in Noobstown Spawn, so 
and like I said, you know, this is a live map. You can hover over here on the right-hand side, and you can go to the Wild World. And here is the Wild World. Uh, looks like a bunch of people have built up right around spawn. Um, and I'll show you on another video how to um, when actually play some on the character character not a crafty I'll show you how to access the different the different worlds how to use wild go um, which is what you use to get into the wild and, and claim your and claim your chunks in the wild uh, so this is really this is really neat um, I'll show you the uh, game statistics uh, right here. Uh, it shows the different categories. Here's the MC MMO skills that I was talking about. Um, top 10 noobs uh, for power level, combat, average miscellaneous skill, average gathering skill. And you've got alchemy, acrobatics, archery, axes, fishing, excavation, herbalism, uh, mining skill, You've got repair skill, sword skill, unarm, taming, and wood cutting. So that that is really neat, and just you know, feel free to go through the different categories oh, and pull them up because that is really interesting. Um, all of the uh, different uh, things you can view on there. And let me show you the donate under the donate. And I want to touch on this briefly. Uh, you can donate for different in-game perks uh, within Noob's Town. And what, one of the ones that I really, really, really like is the VIP upgrade. And I will show you on the VIP upgrade, uh, what is really nice about this one is the command craft. You don't have to uh, have a workbench anywhere around you. You can just do Command Craft. It automatically opens up a workbench there for you. Um, the Ender Chest, uh, Command Ender Chest, that is like having a second chest uh, or second inventory on you. <coughs> Excuse me. So that is really nice um, because when you when you die. Of course, you know, you, you possibly can lose everything in your inventory. However, if you have your ender chest, uh, and if you have stuff in your ender chest, you will not lose those items in your ender chest. So that, that is really nice to have. Uh, your command J, your command jump, uh, that is really nice if you're out exploring the mining world, um, or the nether, or the end, whatever, you can just... Uh, point your cursor in the direction you want to jump and it teleports you to the block in your directional line of sight so that is really nice your command set home uh, as a member you get uh, I believe it is uh, two home sets uh, with a bed I believe but as a as a member you get five home sets uh, which is really nice um, you can also bypass the TPA teleport delay as a member there is a five second delay when you want to TPA to somebody when they accept the TPA then you have to stand there for five seconds uh, and wait to actually teleport if you move then the request will be canceled however with the VIP upgrade you can bypass that and when somebody uh, if you send somebody a TPA request and that person accepts it you autom as soon as they accept it you automatically go um, the command back is really nice uh, you have back on death now, which means, you know, if you happen to die in the mining world or, or just say in the mining world and you, when you respawn, as long as you do not go any place else, if you just do command back, you will go back to where you died and hopefully you can gather your belongings provided they have not just burned up in lava. Um, and then you can see the, the different other... Um, different other perks to the VIP upgrade. So I'm going to cancel out of that. Um, but there's also, let's click on in-game items and I can show you what um, let 
and it just I'm not sure where it just went okay in game items here uh, scroll down try this again here we go okay scroll down you see the VIP upgrade you can get a pig spawner um, a horse bundle a pet bundle you know you can get different um, different things there uh, which is really nice a lot of people will um, let's go under extras a lot of people will buy extra home sets which is nice I believe when you buy this you get 10 uh, 10 home sets um, which is really nice uh, there is a there is a place here that you can buy oh it's under global a lot of people will buy the global um, double XP and that is that is for everybody that is on the server if you were to donate um, for this uh, it does turn on double XP for is it one hour or two hours I think, uh, one, I think it's one hour I, I forget now and I apologize but um, yeah that, that is really nice uh, a bunch of people do that quite often um, and turn double XP on and everybody grinds uh, to whatever they want to I sometimes do herbalism and mining uh, some people do tree cutting taming uh, so that is really nice but anyway, uh, that's just a few of the things on the website. But like I said, it's, it's fairly important to uh, check the website often uh, because there will be updates on what's going on on Noobstown. The admins do a really good job on keeping things updated and up and running. So I want to show you two my messages. If you are not online uh, or if a player that you're trying to reach is not in game, uh, you can either send them mail. Um, in game with command mail send and then their name and then the message or you can come to the website here and send a message um, you can click on send a message here I'm not going to send one um, but you just you know put whoever the player's name is here and then of course you know the subject and, and your message uh, and then they'll get it so yeah you know, it's another way to contact a player if you're not online or if they're not online uh, but I believe that may be about it. Let's run over to I'm gonna run over to the server and see if I'm actually See if I'm actually a member now, but like I said, I wanted to touch on a few of the things on the website um, For you you see the noobs here. I've got 5,996 noobs. I think you start out with 5,000 I think I think you start out with 5,000 noobs on the game <coughs> excuse me let me get something to drink here so uh, but this is this is what we use in game currency wise you can earn money uh, a few different ways you can do command vote and vote for the server uh, that really helps the server out when you vote uh, and you get 25 you can vote once per 24 hours and you can also get 2500 noobs per each time you vote so each day you can earn 2500 noobs when you vote uh, you can also when you go mining or you know uh, work on excavation whatever you can sell things to shop um, a lot of people do that to earn money that's really a good way to earn money uh, and you can also uh, sell things to if you go if you're on the server and you want to sell something if you have like an enchanted sword you want to sell you can go to uh, command a h we have uh, like a little uh, auction thing there with command a h and you can put things up for sale there or you can just post it globally that you have a, a uh, like a diamond enchanted sword uh, that you want to sell and a lot of people a lot of people do it that way so let's go ahead and pop on the noobs town here for just a minute and we'll see if I'm actually a member uh, see there's 24 people on so let's jump on here and see what 
oh, and we are in a, if you see here in my chat, we are in a, currently in a double XP. So, and you can see here, um, so you can tell as soon as I log in, uh, I have no new mail. So, of course, I wouldn't have any mail on this one because I just started. So let's hit tab and see if I am a member. And it says right here, not a crafty. I am a member. So that is good. And who just popped up? There's Fluffy Kitten. She's one of my daughters who plays here. So hi, Fluffy. And she just said hi. So I will show you real quick. Um, I can go into... Uh, do ch, do command ch space l for local, and I can type back in, hi. That's right, I'm not, I need to be added as a friend on here, because I can't open up her doors. Thank you, Fluffy. So see, this is Fluffy's little... Uh, little plot over here. She's got a big giant cookie. So we'll just kind of walk around Fluffy's plot here for a minute. Oh, and I have an incoming. Zombie. I'll go ahead and take a few swipes at him. Yay! Kill the zombie. Oh, I was showing you about the, um, Ah, this is perfect. I can show you the heads that... that see, this is this is her uh, little museum of heads that she has been collecting. Uh, this is the Rocket Man head from the Robots vs. Aliens month um, that we did. That's really kind of a... That's a cool head. That was a... Um, that was an alien head. And then see, here we've got uh, a snitch head from Wizard Month. That was really fun. We had a, um, the Wizard Month was kind of a Harry Potter themed um, month. And we actually, hey Bama, what was that thing that we did? The, um, where everybody was in the room and we all got brought up there and. Sorting ceremony. Yeah, we actually had a, a sorting ceremony where, where everybody Got their houses picked. Got their houses picked for them. Uh, that, that was really neat. Slither uh, new for Slytherin, Raven new for Ravenclaw. Yeah, so that was really fun. And then here's a fire core from Robot, Robots vs. Aliens. Here's a fire core from Robots vs. Aliens. See, that's a really neat looking head. So, and then I am being asked to come up the ladder, so I will go up the ladder and see what Fluffy Kitten has. Saying she's got some more heads up here. So here's, here's a Creeper plushy uh, head from Halloween that we just had this last October. Uh, here's a Witch head from Wizard Month. And I have four floors in it. Oh, she has four floors in this. And then here's a Venus head from Robots vs. Aliens. So we have a lot of collectible heads. Here's Clyde. From Newbween. From, uh, from Newbween. Oh, and by the way, you, you've uh, misspelled Newbween. You've got an M instead of an N, honey. Oops. Yep. Uh, and then we've got uh, the Pumpkin Mask. Also from Newbween. Blood Skull from Newbween. Uh, Inky from Newbween. Golden Skull got, from Newbween. Yep, Golden Skull from Newbween. Then we've got uh, Dallas, Dallas Mask. Mask. Blue Zombie from Newbween. Yep, Blue Zombie. The Creeper Plushie from Newbween. Yep, the Creeper Plushie from Newbween. The Little Mob Spawner, which was from Adventure Month. 
Ah, a little mob spawner from Adventure Month. So, see, we, we do have, you know, every month we have a, a themed themed month. Uh, this month, uh, of course, you know, is uh, Easter themed. So, and I will do a video on um, the Easter theme. And I actually uh, got two of the eggs already. I got this one. Yeah, and Fluffy actually has two of the heads already. I have this one. So she's got that one. And I got this one. Yeah, that's cute. It's a violet Easter egg. Ah, it's a violet Easter egg. What was the other one called, Fluffy? Red Easter egg. Red Easter egg. So. And then as well with the um, eggs, you also get Easter reward tokens, and they're perf and it says perfect for trading in Easter 2016. Right. So, the, so those tokens, you hold on to those. Uh, when you find the Easter egg, it'll give you tokens. You keep the, uh, of course, you keep the uh, Easter egg head, uh, and you keep the tokens. And then this coming weekend. Um, apparently there's going to be a time that you can trade in your tokens for some other rare uh, Easter heads. So we don't know what those are going to be as of yet because we have to wait and see. So anyway, but uh, that's how easy it is and fun to register. So y'all come join us on Noobs Town. Uh, we love to uh, love to see new players come on and everybody uh, in game is always really helpful so if you have any questions uh, in game just you know please be sure and ask because there's going to be somebody there that uh, is going to be more than willing to help you so i hope this was a helpful video to everybody uh, you can go to like i said noobstown.com uh, to get registered uh, i showed you the um showed you the, the IP address that you can access Noobs Town and, and get started playing. So I uh, hope you all enjoyed the video and hope to see you on Noobs Town. You all come join us and have fun. I'll see you next time. Bye.